Living in the city has been, it's been different. <laughs> That's for sure. Can you believe all this is to park? No, I can't. It's like a total alien world, if you ask me. Everything is different. That can't be what that is. That is what that is. All nine family members were forced to stay at a local motel. Futuristic so. Oh, well, hold on, what are you doing? Ah, I'm splattered it everywhere. I think the uh, powder form would probably work better. There are a lot of restrictions, uh, a lot of places you can't oh, yeah. go with your dog, a lot of things you can't do. There's a restroom, but you need a code to get in. Try one, two, three. I had to retire my knife for a little while. Uh, it's not even my large knife. Ah, guys up there working on a roof. They're pretty awesome to climb up there. Bear is constantly trying to climb everything. That's not very appropriate down here. It's kind of noisy, and a lot of times I feel a little claustrophobic, to tell you the truth. Listen to that. Yeah. You hear that? Should I howl? I almost went to. The first night, Bear went over the window. He said, watch this thing. And he just opened the window about this far. <laughs> and it just, it's freaking him out. So different. Yeah. To me, it's really kind of reminded me a lot of when we left. So which one of these am I supposed to take right now? I think it's time for this one. Can you believe all this? After receiving medication and being monitored by doctors, Billy has an announcement for the family. I just want to go home. I really do. You know, after being down here for three months, I'm good to go. I'm good enough to go home. I think everything I can do now, I can do better at home. I definitely think the whole family is ready to go home. They're, they're ready to get back to our own world. There is no doubt that the time we've spent down south has made me appreciate everything in the bush, everything in Browntown even more. You get complacent to the beauty and the wildness and the freedom that you have because it's, it's so normal. You get down here and you realize what great gifts those are and how fantastic of a life we really have to be able to just do what we want and to live free like we do. But the natural world can be unkind, and the Browns will have their work cut out for them. First thing we got to do is get Browntown back together. <laughs> We're looking at mass work when we get home. There's no doubt Browns are ready for the challenge of bringing Browntown back. I think being back in Browntown will definitely make us whole again. It's kind of like a binding that holds us together. The bush is a part of the Brown family, and the Brown family is a part of the bush.